It was once a sopping mess. Tonight, it's a sea of green. This is what Sully's Irish pub looked like in Medina. Just a few weeks ago, it was flooded by a pipe that burst during the January Arctic blast. But today, a much different picture. The pub filled to the brim for the St. Patrick's Day celebration. News 5's Taylor DeHaye shows us how the pub recovered just in time to use the holiday to make Northeast Ohio a better land. A celebration with both young and old, dancing, singing, and toasting. 364 practice days for one St. Patrick's Day at Sully's. That's our one of our shirts a couple years ago. With smiles, ear to ear, General Manager Ali Burmeister remembers this water wall to wall after a burst pipe flooded the entire pub. Our bar floor, uh, the entire wood floor, our bar top, which was custom built. $50,000 worth of damages, Burmeister says they closed for 15 days, a short time thanks to the community rallying together in hopes of reopening by St. Patrick's Day. The community saying, hey, let's go have dinner at Sully's. Hey, let's go support them when they reopen. And that's where we really kind of made our comeback. This place was wrecked. There was 12,000 gallons of water that flowed through here with a broken pipe. John Holthouse is a regular at Sully's and just like the St. Patrick's Day traditions, Sully's has one of its own. If you want to sit in one of their booths, you'll have to pay a few gold coins. This booth was $120 for three hours. Every penny goes straight to a local charity, the Trinity Rose Foundation, benefiting blind children. That tradition started five years ago. Just doing three-hour time slots of guaranteed space to sit for St. Patrick's Day. And this year, the pot of gold holds more than $4,000. Celebrations started this morning and at midnight for Holt House. It's my birthday, for God's sakes. So I feel like a rock star. But coming here makes it that much better. I go to big cities every year, but I don't do it anymore because I want to be right here. Even getting a lucky charm from the owners. Sully's is Medina. You can live here and lived here all your life, or you could have just moved here yesterday. And when you come here, you feel like family. In Medina, Taylor DeHayes, News 5.